it was announced that the Fast and Furious franchise is going to end after the eleventh film. No. So this is sad, sad news. No, it's uh, it's reasonable. This franchise could have outlasted my entire life, and I would be fine with it. Yep. Like on my deathbed, I was hoping like at least I know that there will still be new Fast and Furious movies coming out, and now I guess there won't be, which is devastating. Are you upset? I'm pretty upset. Why are you upset? I'm upset because Fast and Furious is incredible and amazing, and all they really need to do is keep adding badass people. Yep. And fast cars. It's expendables of cars. That is the plot, and I am for it. I guess I have to watch them. You've never watched them? I've seen, oh. I've seen the first one. The first one's good. Oh, oh it goes dude. well off the rails. Yo. you got to keep watching it. It goes a little weird. The first one's good, dude. The first one's good. But, like... Do you really need all of those? Yes. It's just a seat of to, to stunts. Tip. Can I ask you a question? Ryan the Lion. Yeah. I'm being serious. Mm-hmm. I want to delve deep into the <laughs> Ryan the Lion spirit here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. If you could have 20 Fast and Furious films or 20 Star Wars films. Oof. Are there are there already 20 Star no, there's Wars? No, there's not. There's not. How many are there? Like 15? 11. 18? Yeah. There's 11. 11? That seems mm-hmm. low. No, Don't not. honestly answer that one. There's three, six, and nine, right? There's there's the nine trilogy films plus Solo uh-huh. and and Rogue One, and there's plenty of other uh, outside there like TV shows and stuff. But let's just talk uh-huh. with films. If you could continue the Star Wars franchise or continue the Fast and the Furious franchise, just curious. They're extraordinarily different because you. the Star Wars franchise basically Star Wars has a cohesive story that it builds. The Fast and Furious franchise doesn't need much of a story it's which is why i think that they could continue basically forever because the story is just hey we got fast cars and we got tough dudes and they're gonna do some stuff you in it's like yeah i am in so my follow-up question on this story is they're still gonna make that movie but they're not gonna call it fast and furious why are they doing the opposite of all other movies that use the name to get people into the theater? yeah like just keep it going i mean dominic toretto's character could live on forever. He essentially can't die. Stop. We mean can't die. He's not a Sith. He's not a- everlasting. No, but you haven't seen what he's been through, man. <laughs> when Dominic Toretto is in a car, he is invincible. I have seen him survive things that should have killed him ten times over. It doesn't yeah. matter because then they can turn it into his kids or his brother or his yeah. Oh, so he's James Bond. Yeah, he could be. He could be James Bond. Yeah. Yeah, but these movies aren't that good, right? Like, are they that good that they're James Bond movies? Are these are these 007 type films? So the franchise it had some ebbs and flows. Like the first one was good, the second and third ones were a little rough, and then the fourth one was all right, and then the fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, like those all got really good from the fifth one on. Oh wow! I gotta wait till the seventh one. I think The Rock did it. Once The Rock entered the franchise, it changed the game. Well, that's what we thought. What did you think of this entertainment news story? Comment below.